Bonjour, c'est moi. That does not even translate correctly. Hello, it is I. Okay, so in one of my last videos, I got a comment from... Haha, <laughs> that's a shiny or joke, I shouldn't use that at all. So this fellow subscriber wanted me to make a video on 10 things that did not make sense in Forza Horizon 4. Okay, now I made one video on this before... Oh no, wait, I made two videos on this. No, wait, I made three. What the hell's wrong with me? While you guys are getting a fourth one. You mad? Because in Forza Horizon 4, there's a lot of things which, uh, do not make sense. And because we keep finding bugs and glitches and things in the game which make zero sense at all. So yeah, before we get into this video, let's try and obliterate 6,000 likes, yeah? Wow, that's six. That's like three and three put together. But a new goal, yeah? Let's try and hit it 12 hours after this video is released, yeah? That is mad. I don't think we've ever done that before on this channel, you know? So let's break a world record, yeah? For my channel. Six, six thousand. <laughs> I have to give up with my fingers. So yeah, 6,000 likes 12 hours after this video is released. That's a world record, you know? Also, make sure to subscribe to my channel if you are new. We're trying to hit 135 by the end of this month. 135k, by the way. And uh, any help will be greatly appreciated we're so close to it and i know you guys can do it okay that would be mental 135k oh you mad anyways without further ado that was a really long intro let us get into this video number one time travel now let's say it's night time you are cruising in your expensive hypercar and you want to make it home so you can drive with better visibility well let me enter my home and oh would you look at that it has instantly changed to the morning how convenient now let me exit my house so i can drive my center during the day to Oh, it's night again? Yeah, I thought so. This makes no sense. Come to think of it, when has it ever been nighttime when you're at your house in Horizon 4? It's always bright. Like, when do you actually sleep in Horizon Britain, man? Number two, the snowman. Now, we all know what happens if you destroy a snowman. This is what it looks like. However, if you destroy one of those smiling snowmen in our cars, this is what it looks like. This makes zero sense, man. The body and head are still intact and... Wait a minute, the snowman's frowning. Does this mean that snowmen are alive? Okay, I'm starting a new movement in Forza Horizon 4. Hashtag destroy all snowmen. Number three, engine swaps. This is my Lamborghini Huracan, a very Italian car with a very German heart. Now let's say you want to swap out its engine for an Italian one, perhaps a Ferrari engine. Well, you can do just that. Wow, what a trait we think to do. Now let's hear it. Now that sounds a lot better than the artificial Audi V10. You know what? I'm gonna have a look at the engine because it might even look better as well. What? So you're telling me that I still have the V10, yet it sounds like a V12. This makes absolutely no sense, man. Number four, running out of fuel. So here I am driving my Holden, oh no, sorry, my Vauxhall Monaro, and I'm driving with simulation damage on, meaning the fuel will eventually run out. So I'll catch up with you guys once it has. Later. Okay, my fuel has now run out and I can still drive my car. What great technology Horizon Britain has to offer. Number five, scent lock wheels. Here I have a McLaren F1, a legendary hypercar or supercar, I don't know. It has three seats a glorious BMW V12 and its iconic center lock wheels. Now let's say for whatever reason you're not a fan of these and you want to change them up. Well, you can do just that in Forza Horizon 4 and <gasps> are those lug nuts on a car with center lock wheels? How on earth does that make sense? Are you dumb? Number six, force fields. I am flying my drone over here. I really want to enter the festival with my drone, but there's an invisible wall preventing me from doing so. How annoying is that? However, if I find one of these yellow gates, the drone flies right over and allows me into the festival. So what is this force field technology that Kira has been developing over the past years? Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Kira. <laughs> Number seven, removing your spoiler. Damn, is that a Supra? I'm sorry, that's a really dead meme. As you can see, this Supra here has a spoiler on it. It looks decent, but I'm looking for a clean look. So let me remove the wing and that will be free, of course, wouldn't it? Uh, oh no, 100 credits. 100 credits to remove something of my car. Mate, they should be paying me for this. These spoilers go for a lot of Wonga. Number eight, wide body cars. Wide body cars need a lot of cutting up the fenders to install the full kit. So let me show you something that doesn't make sense with this. Here I have a Subaru BRZ. Now as you may or may not know, this car has a rocket body kit available. So let me put that on. Very nice. Now if I take it off, surely the fenders must be ruined, right? 
what is this sorcery number nine dances so as you can see your character can do dances that you've unlocked in the game i mean look at this nasty dab and now he's a ballerina wow as they can do these dances they can also do dances that are locked too so why can't these be unlocked already he clearly knows how to do those dances is he refusing to do them then because kira told him not to this is very inhumane of kira to do we need to fire kira and get alex from horizon europe back and finally at number 10 postcards let me crash into the post boxes right here now hopping on to photo mode you'll see many postcards of which all of them are horizon australia ones so the people of horizon britain are so bored of the seasons in the uk that they're promoting australia how very un-british of them to do this so surely in horizon australia if you crash into the post boxes you'd see horizon britain postcards uh, oh well it seems like everybody hates the uk and those are 10, 10 things, and those are 10 things that make zero sense in Forza Horizon 4. If you guys learned anything new or enjoyed the video, then you know what to do, my G. Hit that nasty like button. Who's nasty, Fox? I don't know who that is. What the hell's wrong with me? Hit that, hit that like button, yeah. 6,000 likes is the target, or your mother's name is Margaret. Bars. And if you're thinking to yourself, wow, this guy's cool. I want to waste 10 minutes of my day every single day, yeah, to consume some of his content, yeah, then you know what to do, yeah. Subscribe to my channel. Waste your time with me. I'm your time waster, you know. I love having new faces on my channel, and yeah, new subscribers are very nice. I like them. Plus, I also read like pretty much all of the comments within like the first half an hour of my video release because I love reading your supportive comments and I don't want to seem like a terrible influencer who doesn't care about his subscribers and stuff. Okay, I'll read your comments here. Yeah. So, yeah, until next, my head's a mess. Until next time, have a good one, guys. Stay safe. Stay inside. Until next time. Hey, they said they cheers. like it when I rap like this. So I reckon I'm better off giving them that. I really be one in a million killing the shit when I hit like a swing in a bar. Average. You and I rapping like this. They're the fuckers I'm gonna die. If you ain't gonna listen to this, how the fuck you gonna listen to that? What you be